What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko and we're here after locals at a little restaurant with your boy Cher and that's because Cher went undefeated so to celebrate oh. he got his little black bean noodles his oh. uh Nero Ho Fun Oh yeah Did I say that right? It's actually, that's actually pretty good Oh yeah, nice Beef noodle sort of thing with black bean sauce it's so like very tasty This is a celebration meal Yeah this uh, is like part like tier tier one here like on the menu like tier one Tier one on tier the menu. One dish, the tier yeah. zero menu? Yeah, you should try it. Like tier zero, like I'll show you some other time, but this is tier one. Okay, okay. So yeah. what did you play at Locos tonight to go undefeated? Okay. I, I, I know what he played. He played something spicy. Something spicy you guys spicy. probably haven't seen in a long time. And then we got there just to show you a spoiler. It's guru control. Yeah, it's not just any guru. It's just it's, some it's a chair spice. Spice. Always spice, you know? All right, so let's get into the deck profile then. Okay, so for at first, and then we can play the staple, of course. Just a guru package, you know, just like in the city, you know, search any card, you know, search any step tier card in your hand. So you just we usually search like guru. Yep. And then if you have, you open guru, just search Findis. Or if you open both, just search like final battle. Mm -hmm. So depends, but usually just like, you know, it's just free search. And then this have like a, something that goes along with one of the cards I'm playing. So it's actually good. I'll show you later, but. And then tier for me, of course, you know, more consistency. And then the one near Karate, you know. So if you see the hidden, uh, hidden yeah. city, you just go Necro? Uh, no, so basically you do hidden city first, you get your stuff going, yep. and then you uh, and then just you replace it with Necro Rally, yeah. Okay. Okay, those are staples. I would have been a missing mine, but I guess. Nah, no missing mine. Yeah, no one missing mine, right? But it is what it is. Okay, the next curse spice. I'm also playing the Nadir package. How did, how did you feel about the Nadir package? Oh three my, servants, of course. It's actually pretty broken. So, but the thing is, you have to be careful. I'm actually playing Maximus in this deck. Okay. So it's very risky if you're playing against tier player. But you signed it out. I'm assuming against tiers. Uh, actually, it depends because I have a card that I can like play it first before I do my Maximus play, so it stops from tier from doing their things anyway. Oh, so it doesn't okay. matter. So I'll show you. But sometimes, if I know I'm playing against tier. I might not go for Maximus. I'll just add like Ecclesia or something. Yep. So it depends on the matchup, right? But of yeah. Course. So this card is like free, and you disc, uh, what's it called? This card go run. It's like free draw. It's like engage basically. Oh, that's facts. Yeah, so much card of it. For the deck. Basically, so much advantage just off this one card. Yeah. And then like, it's just I love this card. You're playing this. I, I noticed that you're playing this engine in a lot of decks that you built. I ah, I just like it's, it. It's a powerful yeah. engine. Huh? Exactly right. right. I love it. Yeah. It's just like and it's German secret. So I just. Ah, they're pretty. Know, yeah, they're pretty. Yeah, it's so pretty. There know. you go. Okay, and then pots, you know, I, all my decks need pots, right? Yep. Like dig for six, like you dig for the Dare Servant or Hidden City, you know, it's just consistent, consistency, yep. right? And then going second, you just want to dig your side cards. Okay, those are done. Then the next spot, Ace we have. Oh. Okay, so I was going to ask you, because I looked through your deck yeah. earlier. How are you bridging with Small World in this deck? I will show you, but... This card is actually just more consistent C card, right? Because okay. for my deck, I just need to see one card to win the game. Okay. And I'm just using this to dig that card out, right? And so I'll, sh I'll show you the bridge after, but I'm playing this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then the other two spell have Rikaki. Yeah. So basically just, you know, good going second if you, you know, lose the dice roll. You want to go first though, right? I always want to go first. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. this is just in case you lose dice roll. Yeah. But yeah. And then, of course, the one monster, you know, is coming up soon. But like, you summon that guy first and use this. The it, tier can, yeah, they can't do anything about it, right? Like, doesn't matter what they have on the board. So okay. It's like nice board wipe. I was playing like Tikapu before. Yeah. But I haven't faced like birds that often in local. So it's cut it out. Yeah, and Tikapu's not that great into tier. Yeah. And so. I'll just see like the matchup at locals. If there's like more bird player, I'll just swap it. But right now, I don't see any birds right now. So I just play the Regaki. And this is good against birds too, so. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you can always just get rid of yeah. the barrier statue, exactly. get rid of the just, MP and just, whatever. Yeah, the deck already has like okay matchup against birds anyways. Okay. Like all those, you know, traps and stuff, so it's okay. And then we're going to do the monsters now. Got the Fenrir. Fenrir is like, it's like, just like so free, like plusing, you know, it's like such a like pressure against your opponent. Every time you drop him, like the opponent is already under pressure, right? And then he searches one, you know, you just replace, replenish itself, right? Yeah. And also, uh, the thing with this is Earth. Is that relevant in your deck? Uh, yes, I'll show you why. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna show you. Uh, all the gurus and the uh, Phoenix, they're all Earth as well. Okay. So they're sort of like also small world bridges, you know? That's how you're bridging. And then also when you search one with the Fenrir, the one you're adding is gonna be the small world bridge for free. 
That's oh, that's true. Okay, yeah, so you're gonna end on a Fenrir. Plus, exactly. you get to search for so whatever you need. So if you break, you finger, you use Fenrir, and then you reveal one of the Guru, and then you can search the last piece you're missing. Oh, nice. Yeah, so you you only on two Guru though. Uh, two Guru because I play a lot of normal summon in this deck. I don't want to break on it. Okay. Like Fiendus is also sort of like a normal summon. So if you draw too much of it, it's not good, right? Okay. And also play the Nadir package. There's also Ecclesia, right? So oh, that's true. Too many normal, and the Hidden City is like already five copy of the Guru right there. Yeah. You don't want like open too many gurus you know it's not good that's fair okay that's the guru package and then we're gonna have where is it the dog meta cup dog meta cup package yep and basic just basic right uh before i didn't play these two i just played two ecclesia and then later like i saw this guy at the ycs he was playing like this one the and floor. it's really good yeah like he used this and then chained floor to negate one of the on in the gate or something and then we got the whole board like that was like spicy and this like been pretty mvp for the board yeah and also i had a maximus because i want to test because this card sometimes need like more cards to play right because you want to always like draw more cards yeah and then so what i do with this so basically the play is if i open the deer i ditch gorora i draw one i search him banish gorora and then you special this uh, you make sure to two. Yeah, you uh, make sure you're not. They are not playing tier or anything, right? So they cannot say kick callus or anything. And then you activate effect. So uh, and you send Fergi and uh, what's it called Titanic clad. Yeah. So Fergi gets you another draw. You put back whatever. So usually I already added one uh, extra finger with the you know with the finger search. Yeah. So I just put back the finger, right? And then get a free draw. And then in phase I can uh, special or add a dog medical monster so I usually add this to my hand yeah. so that's like uh, another so you have another form of destruction another, um, this is really yeah. good into the rogue matchups right exactly yeah so because they, they have the stand like they're like stuff that's not like they don't get an event yeah advantage, advantage. Right? Yeah. and that costs this like, so many stuff like Intus Garura Omega and there's so much options right? going second it's a decent board breaker then I exactly. guess too, right yeah it's yeah. pretty good Okay, those are, and also play Ultimate Slayer and Super Poly, so I have so many targets to oh, send. Oh, fair. So this like all works together, right? Yep. That's the only reason I'm not playing Shifter because it you can't play Shifter in the Deer package, right? It's, yeah, it doesn't, doesn't work, work. It doesn't yeah, work. Yeah. It's too breaky. And I don't like Shifter because like too breaky if you draw it later in the game. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. And then the whole thing that makes the deck works, of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah, Dina, like, exactly. Dina is literally the boy. That's the boy, right? That's you want to drop this on them, and then and you go Regaki. You Regaki, you guys. Do... I watched him do that. Yeah, I watched him do that for a game. <laughs> this is not even a joke. It was funny. I watched him go Ultimate Slayer yeah. on the Baron. Yeah. So he had so his opponent had a Baron to floor, a Draco Stapelia, and a Rule Close. Yeah. I believe, right? Exactly. Yeah. So it was against a tier limit player. He goes Ultimate Slayer on the Baron, normal summons Dyna, Rigaki. and goes Regeki for game. That's so nasty. And then he was nasty. like 600, he couldn't do anything. Yeah. Just punch him, 12. GG. I watched it happen live, boys. This yeah, is crazy. It's funny. So yeah, that's the main boy of the game. You always want to get him ASAP on the board as soon as possible. So the small world basically is all Does it help because he's also on Earth? That's the main reason I play. So small okay. world, right? So all the things I play, they all bridge to him, right? Like Finrir into any su so Findus or Guru, that's like just search to him, and then you can use Demon Ecclesia because they're level four, and you search a Guru, and then you search Dino. Oh, yeah. int so, okay. So so, but most of the time I just use the use Finrir. Finrir, extra Finrir, right? It's yeah. just so free, right? It's like free, anyways, right? It's yeah. Just turn into a Dino, and then uh, if you open both Dino and Guru, you always go for Dino first because the Dava lock them out. And then you print their normal summon for the turn, and then the next turn you play Guru, and then you just uh, so I'll show you the combo for the Guru here too. Okay. So Hidden City and then Guru by itself is like protection for Dinah every turn. So you're always starting with Dinah though. Always right? start with Dinah because okay. you wanna click the, like uh, cripple them, right? They yeah, can't yeah. play anything. To have try to beat over it, use any like normal trap, like whatever you search, and then just get over. It. And the next turn you open Guru, you do Guru Guru plays, right? So what happens is like so. So we have this, you go in first, you have this, you get that on the board, and you have one trap to protect the, whatever, the norm, something they try to beat over it. Yeah. The next turn, you activate Hidden City, you search Guru, and you set it, and flip, search Fiendis, and then during their turn, they're gonna try to beat over it again. So you negate it something, this will be face down, and then you get the attack, uh, Hidden City, flip back up, negate the attack, you search one. So they're constantly- And then Fiendis is then live again. Exactly, oh, okay. they're trapped in a loop, and the next turn you just use Fiendis to beat over what they have, and then just slowly just, they cannot okay. come back, yeah. It's just like... So this is kind of a deck that like snowballs, right? Like after turn yeah. one, turn two, if, you're just getting more and more advantage. Yeah, if they can't get over the Dyna turn one, they're usually just dead. Okay. 
do that too fast, can you imagine? And then of course the Dyna protections just to get rid of their normal summons. So you're just putting a bunch of traps to protect Dyna here? Basically, yeah. So anything they summon normal that's bigger than Dyna has like, to go. Get, get rid of it. Okay. And then it's pretty much GG from there. Yep. Yeah. So it's a punishment because we play in the Dare Pack already. Crackdown is also pretty spicy because uh, Guru, after they flip the, you take their monster. Yeah. And you used to Guru to put their stuff fake down. And you flip fake up and then it's yours. And it's yours. You can attack with it. And then, or you can tribute like Fenrir for it, right? Oh, it's like free, yeah, free like, damage, right? That's cool. I like yeah. that. I never thought of that. I know it's like free. That's why I, I like it, right? And then it's like protect Dina. It's protect Dina, yeah. and then Judgment just say no to all them, whatever, right? Yep. And then the one final battle. Yeah. Only one final battle? Oh, I yeah. guess you're only playing the two. Yeah, I'm not playing. Sense. I'm not playing pure. Right? I'm only playing a Night Card Guru engine. Yeah. It's not even a Guru deck. You know, I call this the Dina Servants deck. Everything is Dive just to Dina Servant. Serve Dina, you know, Dust of Wink Edition. You get Dina out there, he's gonna do everything for you. Oh yeah, that's fair. So it's yeah. forty cards. I'm assuming in the main deck with this. Forty. Always forty. 40. Di okay. Forty sharp. Okay. What do you want to do next? Extra or side deck? You could do extra. It doesn't matter. We're gonna go through it all. Okay, extra deck, the super party targets. Of course. Uh, pretty basic, just this one's like three dark, you know, it comes up, it's funny sometimes. Yeah. It's, it's coming up for, not the, not this time, but yeah. I've seen it come up for yeah. uh, Dragon Link before. And Sprite too, And right? Sprite, Sprite, yeah. I was like, yeah, something like one of those Link, Ring 2, you know, gigantic and then something else like brew or something i just yeah. used away his entire board and then normal dyna he couldn't be over <laughs> that's <laughs> he just so died, crazy right? man like, what and then you know it's like whatever right okay that's fair yeah, those are the standard and then the best uh what's it called the deer and punishment ultimate slayer targets yep three guru you must have play three three intis so versatile punish pop two draw one always draw one and then it's a super party target right yeah of course this card's broken i love it if uh if Flandries is not ending on Barrier Statue, this just breaks their whole board too. Basically, you, yeah. Because if they don't go with Barrier Statue, you exactly. just two birds. Like Impin and something else yeah. like Water or Vein or something, you just use this. Right? That's, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. But usually they do Barrier Statue, so... But yeah. the thing is, if they see you're playing Dinah or Guru, yeah, like, they, probably, they, they might not. Yeah, they might think, they might, you know, Apex. Yeah, yeah, yeah so they might that, go Apex. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and then the last one, Titan Clash. This is actually super clutch. Like, the search, like, one I did. Florida Rays at in phase like always like key. Yeah. But uh, sometimes but I end on Dyna, right? I just search for Ecclesia because what Ecclesia does is another normal summon stopper. You normal her, you search punishment, it stop their whole turn again. Yeah. So just like loop them, right? That's fair. Yeah. Okay, and the other two uh what's it called? Punishment target for versatility and auto Ultimate Slayer targets. Yep. Yeah. So just in case you face some XYZ deck, and Omega just good for replenish your Garura uh, or Intis, you know, just shove them back if you run out. Yep. You know? Yeah, good uh, generic stuff. And then the two Fergie. It's actually pretty clutch. Really? Yeah, because you like, you do. I thought I was just playing one at first, but like drawing two every turn and then putting back one is like so broken, right? Like I send this every turn, like with Maximus, yeah. I keep drawing and then putting back a brick. So, so you're always, just always fixing your exactly hands. right, and the well, I'm like reducing their extra deck count. I'm, I'm plusing off her. Right? It's also a Slayer target. Exactly. Yeah. Also, it's the only link I play, so yeah. it's a Slayer target. Okay, that's the uh, and then for the spices. I know you want to get to your food here, looking nice. Yeah, so. no, it's gonna go. Let's do this fast. And then two Heavenly Prison. Interesting. Yeah. So. And this card is okay. Usually, good go, goes good with Guru, but uh, because I play so many like Power One of like Small World, yeah, Prosperity, and the Dear Servant, Hidden City, it's always gonna come up, right? Yeah. So I can search any spell or trap. So this card is actually good, and it's protect back row, right? That's Just fair. in case, you know. Like the reason I play the Guru package is because I always lose to Evenly or Lightning Storm. But with Guru package, you get the Omni the Gate with Findus. Yeah. So that's why I like the Guru, you know, with the Dyna. So that's so what I'm playing. And also, that's a small world target. It's a rock. Oh, yeah, so it's, rock means it's, you can get it to like Dyna. Dyna, yeah. yeah. Oh my like, god. Like uh, Fenrir into this, into Dyna, or something else. Yeah. Okay. Those are the right. And then those are the only going first side at play. And everything now, else going second? Everything is going second. Okay. People, they, they never want me to go go first, you know? That's fair. Yeah. Okay, and the two. So the third, Rigaki, just in case, you know, want to break their board. Of course. Because we don't have to play any shifter or whatever, so you want to just drop that on them. And then Duster is just finally like back row. Back row. Yeah. And then we play the two, Lightning Storm. I was playing three, but it's kind of tight, so I'm just playing two. Okay. Okay, and just, you know, generic. 
everything and the super body you know for board breaking of yep. course yeah it's powerful dry man it's going for a second right going second you always want to side out the guru package because that's like that's like a night card car night uh, card engine, engine you don't want to see yeah but you're putting all this stuff so it's just like you're playing like pure board breaker and after you break the board you play uh finn or dina beat down okay that's right so yeah so you just cut that and then just cut judgment or whatever because there's stuff going second and then the ultimate slayer of course yeah pretty good it's pretty if you have the room for your extra deck it's play it's pretty good yeah okay. yeah, yeah. It's, i mean it's going into everything exactly it's only because people can't play because you have to have to play birds or my kind of deck to have the room for it yeah because if you're playing tier or sprite yeah. like you don't have room to you play synchros and exactly. and all. yeah, yeah there's no thing but for my deck it's perfect right yeah always like this card and then the best card evenly yeah. evenly there you go all right, perfect. Well, congratulations on your first place uh, oh. with, uh, what do you call this again? Ser Dina Servant? Dina Servants. Dina yeah. Servants. Yes. All right, congratulations. Uh, I know you've been eating, eating meaning yeah. to eat. Yeah, your... it's getting cold. Uh, let me say it properly again. Yeah. Nero, how, oh, oh. oh, it's close. I don't want to forget it. Yeah. No, I don't want to say it because then people are going to think I'm, I'm. No, it's okay. They can't hear you. Nero, man. how fun? Hey, that's actually that, that's good. You got the noodle part good, yeah. How, how fun? fun? How fun. Yeah. How fun. How fun, yeah. yeah. That's how do you say good. beef? Nero? Uh, neuro. 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 Yeah, there. there neuro, you. how fun. There, I'll give you 80%. Okay, whatever. I'll get yeah. it eventually. No, All right. Probably. Thank you, Chair. Yeah. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe if you guys did enjoy. And with that, it's Banco and Shit. Signing out. Peace.